Wednesday morning, and it is, I don't know, it is 10 after 7, so I'm supposed to be out of the house in like 5 minutes. Probably won't happen. Brayden is just chillaxing and trying to wake up. Mm. Look at them sleepy eyes. They're playing on his iPod. Isaiah is eating a big breakfast of... Sloppy Joe's. Sloppy Joe's and a smoothie. Wow. The breakfast of champions, perhaps. Or perhaps not. But it's like three times the breakfast that he normally eats, so we're, it's all good. Going to be a terrific Tuesday. 7.23. I dislike mornings. Well, Tuesday morning, almost to work, and I'm determined at this point to have a good day. I usually call Tuesday terrible Tuesday, but with a positive attitude, it's going to be a good day. A terrific Tuesday, if you will. I don't have a whole lot of faith in it, but... That's how I'm going to try to adjust my attitude. Have a good day. The peace and quiet of the early morn. And there's voicemails and emails. Loads of work to catch up on. It is all good. And even though I say that I love my job, and I do very, very much, um, any day that you're not standing in the unemployment line <laughs> is a good day, as far as I'm concerned. Um, now I know sometimes it's hard to it's hard to keep sight of that, but I think having a job is a good thing, and. Uh, I feel like Mr. Rogers here coming in talking to a camera. I'm tying up my sneakers and putting on my sweater. My cardigan sweater, if I'm not mistaken. I'm doing my very best to have a good Tuesday. Um, but at some point over the weekend, I stepped in dog poop. Well, I didn't notice that until I'm on my way to work. And I I must have looked like I had a gimp leg or something because I was, like, sliding it along. Every bit of grass I could find. No, still didn't come off. Uh, hardly any of it actually came off. So I got to work, and I'm sitting in a meeting with my boss. And I'm like, man, this day. This day smells like crap, even. Anyway, so I went and washed it off and cleaned it all up. And I'm sitting at my desk and... This place smells like crap. <laughs> Anyways, my shoe still smells like crap, which is even slightly worse than my feet would normally smell. So, terrific Tuesday. Two points. And the work day is almost over. Well, it's almost 5 o'clock. Um, it is, uh, well, it's almost 4.30, so we're getting close to 5 o'clock. But I've got a lot of work to do, so I don't know at this point if I'm going to just stay here and keep on working or if I am going to take the stuff home again and uh, work from home. But there's also a church service tonight, and my wife is speaking, and I'd really like to catch that because she is phenomenal. Uh, so I'm not really sure what to do, but either way, uh, we'll uh, plug on. The day hasn't actually been too too bad. It's been a terrific Tuesday, except for the sea of declines in our um, credit application system. But we'll roll with it. On the way home now, and absolutely wrecked. Oh, I'm tired. 
I was falling asleep at my desk. It is five after six. And since 7.30, I worked through my lunch like an idiot. Shouldn't have done that. But anyways, just made me more tired. And I don't think I got any more done because of it. Just wasted. Sometimes I think if you, if you rest up, take some time off, you can get a little bit more productivity in. My productivity today was, was crappy. Anyways, I'm going to go home and uh, have something to eat and hopefully get some more done and still make it to church for this evening. Hey guys, so uh, again here I am saying hey guys. It's had a pretty good day. It was a little too long for my likings, but nothing I could do about that. But it wasn't too bad. It was kind of a lazy day. I came home and didn't do anything. So, uh, yeah. There he stands in the darkness, chowing down. What are you eating? Banana bread. Homemade banana bread. Mama makes good banana bread, Joe. And we are just getting ready to go to church. I wasn't sure if I was going <clears> to <throat> be able to go. And technically, I can't. But can't really miss out either. Um, if you've ever heard good uh, teaching, you'd understand. But my wife is a phenomenal teacher, really good. And she's teaching on kindness tonight, so I probably shouldn't go either because I'm going to feel bad for how kind I'm not sometimes. Christian if you have those. And I can pretty much guarantee that nobody has ever lived on the earth that has all nine of them accomplished. Because that would make it pretty much perfect. And that doesn't happen. But all of us, I hope, are striving to produce the fruit in our lives and to be healthy Christians. Well, Shauna did an amazing job as always. She's a tremendous speaker, as I believe I have clearly stated. Um, anyways, uh, really sorry. Today has been mostly me on video, which... Ugh, that's got to be... Hmm, that's got to be crappy for you, the viewer. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, it was just weird. Uh, we had to do uh, a vlog today just as one day because we carried the holiday uh, vlog, which we probably shouldn't have. We probably should have used all of Monday's footage uh, with Tuesday, which is what I was originally planning, but then we just changed it up because we were so late Sunday night into Monday. Anyways, it was just a little bit chaotic, that's all. Uh, so, uh, we will end the vlog off, um, well, I won't end it off right here, actually. I'm probably going to involve Braidor, but anyways, we're just, I'm just sitting in the church parking lot waiting for Sean and the boys to come out, and then we will, uh, then we will vamoose on home. Uh, Sean has got to go to work, and me and the, boy, the boys can uh, close the vlog off, and uh, Isaiah can get it edited and up first thing Wednesday morning. Uh, but thanks for your patience through today. It's been, kind of, like I said, kind of a weird vlog. Um, but uh, better days coming. Tomorrow, uh, Braden. Uh, has to go uh, to Doc Braces in Moncton, New Brunswick for his braces. He's a little nervous about that, but we're going to uh, vlog uh, those happenings as well. Hiding in the dark. Gonna scare Brayden. Ha <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> uh, part of being a good father, scare the beans out of your boys. <laughs> Brain's getting braces tomorrow. Yes, Brain's going to get his braces tomorrow. Are you, are you nervous? A bit, yeah. 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 Fuck her up. No, I'm not sure your teeth what I actually meant, but. Wow. They're not straight as an overbite. Yes, it's an overbite. From overbiting too many burgers. Um. <laughs> he doesn't disagree with me. So uh, we're going to end it off here, so until next time, turn the crown upside down. Cheers.